How's it guys? Welcome to another video. This is a Quantum Gaming Uploads. And what I wanted to show you in this video guys, is a couple of people have been asking me what's the difference between the all the 777 planes. So we got the 200, the 300, and the F version, which is the cargo version. And I'm going to show you the three versions, just so you know what are the differences in those. So this is the Boeing 777-200ER. You can see, can you see the yellow lines in the tail? That with these planes measures the distance compared to the other versions. So you're gonna, you're gonna see when I show you the next one, you're gonna see the difference. That measures the distance, the yellow lines. That's what it, uh, that's what it's done for. I think it's done on purpose for that. I'm gonna show you what the differences are. I'm gonna show you the cockpit on this one, on the 200ER. Just so you know. As you know, everything is taken from the 747. So it's gonna function exactly like that, and it's gonna fly exactly like that. I'm just gonna show you everything cockpit on this one. So we don't miss anything. Got that, got that, got that, got that, got that. And all this stuff here, the hat. So remember the hat. If the hat is there, you know it's exactly the same. And the hat is there. And all this stuff here. So remember for when I show you the 300 headphones. And let's go to the cabin itself. Because this has a cabin. This is the only good thing about the, these planes. It's got the, you can go to the passengers. It's got the kitchen here it's got the first class i'm guessing here yep this uh these guys living their life yep that's right look at the seats first class and then it starts changing let me go to the normal people over here In the normal seats, you know, with the babies crying and the fat guys eat their crisps. Yeah. So, yeah, guys, this is the interior of the plane itself. So, this is the 200ER. I'm going to go until the end and I can show you. So, we don't miss anything. As far as the interior, it's great that they've done this. That they put this on the plane. Even the, you know, the good planes haven't got this stuff. So that's a great idea for the good planes to have this as well. And they should have. And they should have passengers as well. It would be more fun. You got all the food here, all the drinks. The only thing we're missing here is the stewardesses. Come on. Going in here without the stewardesses is like. Or into a dancing place without the girls. Yeah. As you can see, it's very nice, guys, from the inside. And I can show you the wing from here. You see that moves? You see that? Very nice indeed. So yeah guys, this is the 200ER, what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go back to, okay guys, so this is the 300ER, and as I said earlier, can you see the red marking there, next to the yellow lines, now that's the size difference, the red thing, that's how big this plane is compared to the 200. That's the extra length of the plane. Apart from that, it looks exactly the same. There's no, uh, there's no differences. Apart from... You can see the wings. 
the wing, uh, the wing tip, the wing tips. They got like a uh, longer wings on this one. Okay, so let's go. Apart from that, everything is the same. So let's go to the interior. As you can see, everything is so familiar from the previous one. Air conditioning in and all that, wiper, everything is the same up here. Everything is exactly the same. Got that two small screens that don't work. Yep, same hat. See, we've got another hat in here. Yep, that's the same hat over there. Headphones, headphones, a fire extinguisher, another screen there or something. Yep, let's go back to the cargo bit. Go to the back. Yep, same thing. Got the, you've got the kitchen. Yep. And you got the first class in here. The rich guys and rich girls. Yep. And you got all this stuff like the electronics, the temperature, whatever that is. And again, you got the kids crying again in here. Not in here, but just on this side here. This is where the kids cry. Yep, so it's, everything is the same, it's just a, just the length of the plane is bigger, nothing else. Everything is the same, and the wing, the wing tips are just a bit longer on this plane, because it's a larger aircraft. But apart from that, guys, exactly the same. There's no difference in flying, there's no difference in, uh, in uh, physics, in the air. I found everything the same when I fly this. There's no difference whatsoever. Let me just go to the end. See if there's anything different in there. Nope, same thing. Even got the same drinks and the same place. Yep. So guys, as you can see, exactly the same yep so let's go and uh, show you the cargo version now guys the 777 777F which is a uh, I, lo I love to fly that because of the libraries and all that this are different to these yeah because these are more like for for people and I like to fly the cargo one just 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 because Okay, guys, so this is the 777F, the cargo version. I'm going to show you this, what it looks like. So we've got the same uh, cockpit here, same screens, same everything, same on this side. The only different thing is uh, up here, the cargo section here. I think that doesn't, doesn't open, but that's for the cargo, so it shows like it's a cargo kind of a thing. Apart from that, everything is the same. We've got the same hat. Same hat over there. Fire extinguishers. Fire extinguisher there. That bit there. Headphone. Headphone. Everything is the same. It's no difference whatsoever, guys. Same plane. Same 747 functioning. You can see there. Let me show you. Just so you think I'm lying. There's a 7478i. Everything is plain, and you can see from the engines. This plane's got uh, two engines. In the screen, it shows four. And that's what the 747 has four engines. So that's where everything is taken from with these planes. I'm going to show you the back, the cargo section. This is where the staff sits. Got anything else in here? 
So this is the same section, but it's been uh, remodeled on this to look like a cargo. Show you guys. Yep, there's no more seats, no more crying babies and guys eating crisps. So now you can have some fun in here. You can play football, you can have a race with your bikes and stuff like that. It would be fun, you know. You can have a party in here. You can have like probably 200 people in here having fun. Yeah, now you can just uh, transport cargo. What he's supposed to do, but apart from that, guys, there's no difference in the plane itself, apart from uh, cosmetics. Yep, so this is the cargo. Let's go back to the cockpit. See, everything is the same. Very on the outside, and you got the longer wing tips as well with this version. And the cargo version is the same length as uh, the 200, I would say, because it's got the same markings on the tail, same four yellow markings. But apart from that, guys, they're all the same. I prefer to fly this because I feel like I'm flying a cargo instead of the commercial. We already got commercials in the game, like uh, Airbus 320, 787, so I don't need another airliner we haven't got any cargo so i chose this especially for that because it's a cargo version and it even though it's the same as the other triple sevens it's got the cargo written on it it's got the fedex livery got a tnt livery and the air france livery which uh that's cool i guess but yeah that's what i go for i go for the cargo version myself if i had to buy something i'll buy this one instead of the 200 or the 300 so yeah guys uh, hopefully that uh, clarifies a few things for you guys that haven't got this plane. It's basically a 747, remodeled a plane that is remodeled after the 747. Just it's got a different skin, different size, different modeling. But apart from that, it flies the same, it handles the same, it lands the same. And when you land, it steers the same. It's got the same front wheel mechanism problem. So you're not going to have any, you're not going to feel any difference when it comes to flying with this plane to the 747. Apart from the cosmetics that looks different in the air, the 747 looks massive. That's the only difference. Apart from that, guys, they're exactly the same copycats. This is a copycat of the 747. So hopefully that clarifies things. And uh, thanks for watching, guys, as always. Thanks for liking the videos, commenting. And I love you guys. Take care. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching guys as always, if you like the video please subscribe to the channel.